Sounds great, right? Well, let's make it Mutt Lang great. Next on Music Surgery with Dr. Bob. After first listen, this acoustic sounds great, but listen again and focus on the string squeaks between the chords. Even with DSing and clip gaining downstring squeaks, they're still there. And once you're aware of them, they seem like they get twice as loud. So what does Mutt do? Well, one of the engineers on the Nickelback record, Dark Horse, showed me an incredible technique that Mutt used to de-squeak the acoustic guitars. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is have Dale play the chords of the riff with a click, but extend the ends and not transition to the next chord. So here we go. Okay, we have all of the parts to our little acoustic motif. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cut every one of these roughly. Let's bring our click track in. Second chord goes there. Move it just a touch. Crossfade. Third chord goes here. Bring that down. Little motif goes here. Let's put some crossfades in these. Now let's see if we have our acoustic with no guitar squeaks. And that's how it's done. No squeaks. No scratches. No problem. And there you have it. Like we've talked about before, the great producers like Mutt, Jeff Lynn, and Max Martin use the studio itself as an instrument to achieve the sound they're going for in their head. As song makers, we aren't only creators, but we're problem solvers as well. And tools like this can really get you out of a jam if you're going for a super clean sound. I've just received this text from Mutt Lang. Let me read it to you. Dear Dr. Bob, even though your channel sucks, I hope people will subscribe and ring the bell so I can continue to watch this lame Love Mutt. Special thanks to my great friend and great guitar player, Dale Oliver, for helping me out. And as always, thanks for watching. Also, thanks to everyone for sending messages and leaving comments. Feel free to make requests for future videos and hit me with topics that you'd like to hear about. And I'll see you the next time the doctor's in.